1951 Plymouth, but I was still very, very happy and I have no regrets at all. I, I worked in a luncheonette where I was making a dollar an hour, which doesn't sound like much. But for that dollar, I could buy two hamburgers, a soda, and fries. When you were sick, it was a lot simpler. You could call up your doctor and you'd get an appointment and you could probably go in the same day. And you paid the doctor anywhere from 5 to $15 a visit. Schools expanded in the 50s to accommodate crowded classrooms. And housing ads reflected the growing shift from the cities to the suburbs. My parents built a ranch-style house for the then the ungodly sum of $12,000. And I can remember I had my own room. I had space to play in. They had two acres of land. Here's the 58 Ford Country Squire, one of six new Ford station wagons. And the decade is considered by many the great age of the automobile. A new car was the ultimate status symbol. Fifty-seven Chevy, fifty-six Ford Crown Victoria, fifty-five Mercury, fifty-five Chevys, fifty-seven Mercury was a.